Hey everybody, this is Brad Larson, owner and founder of RentWorks Property Management. In this video, I wanna talk about are furnished rentals a good idea? And so recently we looked at an old video from this post. It, I had done this video eight or nine years ago. And at that point, it was before Airbnb and before VRBO. So now the market has changed. We have all these different websites that can do these short-term rentals, we call it. So essentially the question poses, is a short-term rental a good idea? That depends. It depends on your situation. It depends on how much you are willing to spend on furniture. It depends if you yourself want to be the concierge to every little thing. Long-term rentals can be completely hands-off, completely touch-free. Short-term rentals, you are a experienced provider at that point. With a short-term rental tenant, wants to call you on a Saturday night because they can't figure out the remote control to start the television, it's your responsibility to answer that phone or somebody you hire has to answer that phone. And if they don't, a bad review can literally sink your ship, meaning that a couple of one star reviews, now you have a 3.5 rating and no one's going to want to rent your unit. So it's very, very risky. In addition to a local city council, a local county, a state could just all of a sudden say that short-term rentals are banned. Short-term rentals are outlawed. Dallas, Texas did this and other metros have started to follow. Or they've made it so tough with regulations that it becomes difficult and problematic to continually rent that home without going through a lot of bureaucratic red tape. Property managers out there don't like to manage those types of properties, and if they do, they'll never do it as good as you. My advice to you is strongly consider turning any of your homes into long-term rentals. It's a tried and true formula. Don't try to overthink the system. For further information, feel free to reach out to us anytime. Take care.